Yes, sir. It's your boy B Hayes We're back with another one, guys. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Before we do that, watch out for spam. What's up in the comments down below? Feel free to join VIP to be alerted and never get in and out of plays. Also, watch out for you know all the spam, what's up, all that stuff, guys. So hit me up for a 15 minute, 30 minute phone call, full of value, full of game, change your whole perspective on the market, guys. So let's go ahead and dive right into it. A quick update, guys, on the overall market, a few stocks that we in, get you guys in and out. So as we know, guys, at the the market uh digesting a, a week's long full of earning results we got a disappointing results which i already knew due to common sense we know profits didn't go nowhere near expectations being for the fact that the world is still in in a in a bind meaning the money supply is drying up people is being more meticulous with where they're spending their dollar and things is about to get even you know worse going forward but before things got worse they wasn't going to hit it hit you all at once they want to make it seem as if it's getting better oh inflation is cooling down like they said on a few weeks ago and then on next week next month a couple weeks from now you'll be hearing about how things is rising again and then the things is going to start picking up at a rapid pace so a lot of people is going to be you know trying to look for assets different things that they can buy to make sure their money continues to hold its value a lot of people is going to be going over to crypto but anyways let's get back full circle into the market so a lot of companies was reporting earnings uh on this week a lot of them didn't reach expectations tesla especially a lot of big companies it don't really matter about the smaller ones but whenever the big ones the ones that's in the s p 500 the dow the nasdaq the ones like tesla apple microsoft the ones that's really making the direction side deciding the direction on how the overall market is going to go mainly the the the, the top 10 companies the top 20 companies is going to decide which direction the market truly decides to go in so as well as bitcoin like it control the markets it all as all of it is in sync together at a certain period of time but it can also you know separate and go either way it wants to go but vip was an awesome week this week guys one week before like last week or something it was a hundred percent guaranteed week everything we called out in vip from from call out to sit from buying to selling it was a hundred percent guys so definitely you know shout out to everyone that took advantage of all the opportunities that was given out then as well as this week we had uh successful plays with riot uh first republic bank we also had another successful play with uh bed bath and beyond at the beginning of the week and then we got back in it in the 30s it you know i lost over 500 but on today alone it went up 200 percent and got 400 dollars back so i'm only down 100 dollars right now well it's back down a little more right now as of now but i believe it could possibly pick back up but you know i was okay with losing that it didn't matter i already had did what three four thousand dollars this week off of bed bath and beyond so losing you know giving back 500 that's what i try to tell you guys once we kill the pay the first time i never go back in with the same amount i had the first time that i hit because i'm not going to give back i'm not going backwards i'm going forwards i'm not going to give those gains back to the market so I, if i went in with two thousand the first time and won a couple of racks next time i'm only going in with four five hundred dollars that way i don't care what you do you can go up down left right I don't really care, but obviously I want you to go up and, and, and make the trade be successful. But we already know, guys, uh, as well as uh, First Republic Bank, that stock is about to explode. This is another, you know, same. Uh, I just did a video a couple of days ago letting you guys know it was about to explode. Every video I have been doing recently and tell you guys it's about to go is is being going the first video i did a couple uh, a couple days ago was 100 percent guaranteed with bed bath and beyond it 100 percent went up the next day 30 percent the following day it went up another 30 or 50 percent 30 percent in the day 30 percent after hours that was insane 100 percent in two days right and then at, right after that we called uh riot that went up over you know hunt uh 30 20 percent 30 percent but in options up 100 percent uh then after that we called bed bath and beyond riot we called uh, First Republic Bank. As soon as I called that, in 120 seconds, 60 seconds later, I was already up $1,000, $500 on First Republic Bank when I called that out uh, the other day. So that was up over hundreds of percent. And then we called it out now. We called it out again. 
We call that out at $13.33. It still has a nice, nice potential, guys. Definitely want to get in VIP if you want to know, you know, more details, exactly when to get out and all that good stuff. But I'm letting you know now, letting you know here. I always wait for pullbacks. Don't try to rush in. Never chase. All that good stuff. I love you guys. Edge Boy on Instagram at the Behave Show. Join VIP. Pick me up for a phone call. Got that stuff right there. <laughs> That's funny. Goddamn mouth dry. I love y'all. We out and God bless you. We come.